So immunotherapy has been evaluated in mesothelioma for a long time, but it's only over the last four to five years we are seeing benefit in patients. At the present time, there are two major forms of immunotherapy to treat mesothelioma. One is targeting the tumor antigen mesothelium using antibodies or vaccine, and two of these drugs are in advanced clinical testing, one in the frontline setting called amatoximab, and the other drug, enutimab ravtensine, which is an antibody drug conjugate, is in a registration trial in the second line setting. So that's very exciting that we have drugs in mesothelioma in randomized clinical trial. The other class of immunotherapy drugs which have benefit are immune checkpoint blocking antibodies and dendritic vaccine. And we had presentations at this meeting where we see that about 15 to 20 percent of mesothelioma patients have objective shrinkage in their tumors, which is long lasting. Uh, we are not able to predict which patients will benefit, but it is exciting for a disease for which no drug has been approved since 2004. So I think the future of immunotherapy in mesothelioma using mesothelin targeted agent or immune checkpoint blocking antibodies is really exciting and there are many, many clinical trials going on which gives us hope that immunotherapy could benefit some patients with mesothelioma.